In vitrogen qubit fluorometric quantitation comprises the easy-to-use qubit 4 fluorometer and sensitive, specific qubit quantitation assays. Based on the detection of target-specific fluorescence, this integrated system is more sensitive than UV absorbance based quantification of DNA, RNA, and protein, making it ideal for precious samples and demanding applications. The Qubit 4 fluorometer is simple and easy to use. It's designed so that you can quantitate your sample right out of the box. From the home screen, you will select the type of sample you wish to quantitate. Here, we show how to run the high-sensitivity double-stranded DNA assay. The first time you run an assay, you will only see Read Standards. The instrument will save the standards with a time and date stamp. For subsequent assays, you can choose whether to use the saved standards or run a new standard calibration. You will then follow the on-screen prompt to enter Standard 1, followed by Standard 2. It takes about 3 seconds per read, and the value of each standard is displayed on the graph. The two values refer to the actual fluorescence values. These values are important for troubleshooting. For example, if you were to accidentally put standard 2 in first or in place of standard 1, both values and the graphical display will reflect this error. When the calibration is complete, you can run your samples. After pressing the Run Sample button, a screen will appear that will ask for the amount from your original sample that you added to the assay. This will be between 1 and 20 microliters. You can use the scroll wheel or the plus minus buttons to enter this value. At this point, you can change the unit output for how the results will be displayed. Each assay has its own defaults. The device will save these inputs for future samples. Now you are ready to read your sample. The instrument will calculate the amount of double-stranded DNA in the original sample tube. No further calculations are required. For more information on the Qubit 4, please view our other how-to videos or visit thermofisher.com/qubit.